Walker now in space, though. He's got runners around him. De Silva into the path of Forbes. Forbes one-on-one -on -one with Marcucci, and it's saved again. Here's the save once again. Great ball from Pierre De Silva. You can tell Billy Forbes just slows down a little bit to get it back onto that left foot. Maybe if he keeps going on that right foot, you can tell he just slows down, tries to slot it to the inside. Good work winning it off Michael Salazar. And Francis Atuahena. Here comes Asiadu, threading it through. Flemings is on side. Flemings has options. Still Junior Flemings is centering pass. Bruno Lopez denied by Boner. What a play at the back by the keeper. Another look. It was all Junior all day when he handed over to Bruno. And just a slight little hesitation there by Lopez. And then, boom, oh, just right there into Boner. Great look from our DIFP oh. goal cam there. Burn that's a lot of minutes. Kobayashi. And the save from Cardoni. It's there, and Cardoni with a huge save off of James's bid on the rebound, trying to get the visitors on the board. Down to make the first save. How quickly can you get back to your feet? And he does a brilliant job at that. Flood. Kelly curls this, saved by Rando. No let up from Phoenix. It's a lovely strike from just outside the box. Pixie spot, he must have thought that was going in the back of the net. Good view here. Oh, might, it might have been. Full strength. <laughs> what a ball inside. Opportunity here for Vegas to go on top. Lynch shit, another massive stop. He is the reason right now that this game is 1-1 instead of maybe 3 or 4-1 Las Vegas. One, is he in an onside position as this thing has slipped through? Yes, he is. So that question's answered. And how about the challenge here by Kai Green on the backside? It's a great save by Blanchett. And then watch the follow through as this ball springs itself out. An opportunity on loan from LAFC. Here is Musovski. Saved by Romero. Romero held his ground. Musovski went down the middle, and Romero with an important save here in the fifth minute. To step before I hit it, I don't know if he was expecting the goalkeeper to move, and he's just picked the wrong side. Nearly through one half of action here. That's a heavy challenge, and it's turned over. Ball comes back centrally. Good build up! And another save from Caldwell! Wow. He does it again and denies Pittsburgh right on the doorstep. Corner kick. There he is. Oh, he got to be careful. It seemed like he got the ball though. Here's another one of these passing moves. Dequa, you've got to think he's going to score there. He's actually done everything. How about this for Paul Lewis? Second professional game, back to back games, and he's facing a penalty. Not what you want for a rookie keeper. Got a hand to it last week. Can he keep it out this time in front of the Charleston faithful? Kimoni Smith, save is made by Lewis. August is US well done Super from Lewis. Lewis. He sees it the whole way. And you can tell how much it means for him and the squad to keep this game nil-nil. Well, Paul getting fouled. He's the one who gets fouled the most out of anybody else on 901 FC. Dangerous play. Long shot, big save by Brady Scott as he robs Nico Brett, who broke in after a breakdown. Poppy pass that led to a turnover in the oh. worst possible position. And Brady Scott quickly down to his left, got just a fingertip. Williams against Caldwell, and Caldwell saves it! Tulu pushes aside! What else can you say about this man in goal, Jeff Caldwell? Time again from you and especially when you've gone through a season of difficult moments. But again, huge save here. And this wasn't his first of the night. We've saw two or three saves before this. Again, I have to see here, Drew. I get a strong feeling here. Zico Lewis. There it is. Oh, what a save by Evan Laurel. Diving to his right and getting his right paw on it. Look at this here. So as Evan Laurel cheats over to the left, he has to go back to the oh. right. Well, and Oloski, minutes later, almost did the same thing with his other foot. Ahead, Damas. Damas slices this back. Rando again. 
Calvillo did not. Such dynamic running from Domus, and to have the awareness to split that ball to Calvillo, and yet it's a really well struck first time hit from Calvillo, but it's a better save from Rando. His ability to get to the ball quicker than everyone else and turn on his man, and he released Connor Antley. Fernandez, here's crossed! Dos Santos got his left foot on it, and it's just a miraculous save by Wormel. How did he get in front of that one? I hope this thing replays on Sports Center for the next two weeks. Look at this save by Wormel. Great cross by Fernandez. Excellent strike. Look at the left hand to push it over the bar. Almost impossible. What a save by Austin. Vassal. Well, room to let a shot away. Apollon pushed off the post by Sparrow. You can give respect, but you can't give this much space to someone who's got a left peg that can do this from that distance. Watch the ball barely moving. Knuckles at the tail end of it. Miscommunication between two river hounds, but it'll stay with Pittsburgh. Forbes, lacrosse. Oh, what a save in. Ukul, oh, my goodness. Denying Dequa. Hounds defensively, if this gets whipped back in, look at the runners again. How many options are you going to allow them to progress into the final third with if you're the Birmingham Legion? And yet, even when it does break down, it's very impressive. You have to admire all of the work that they continue to put forth here within this organization. But Oakland are on the attack. Dennis did it cross the line. The assistant referee on the near side says no. C.J. Cochran kept it out in his mind. Charlie Dennis is incensed. He's sure it crossed the line. We'll look again. What's better, the ball or the half finish? I'll tell you which one. Through ball, Traeger one-on-one -on -one with Newton. What does he do? Newton pokes it away. Follow, Brennan save. Did the right thing, trying to take it past the goalkeeper, but just not quite Big mid right enough. there. Big mitt by Newton, and then the follow by Luke Brennan, following the play from behind. Go and Rodrigo Lopez have shown some brilliant two-man games here, and already they've connected as Keko just checks into this game. Here's Archimed. Archimed denied at the line. Follow-up, Quario save again by Blanchett. Oh. This team has to find a way to score. And Blanchett coming up huge. Archimed gets in a great spot. You just want him to put it right in that far corner. And then the rebound, Blanchett once again getting up, and getting enough on it and getting that ball out of the danger area. And he made three fantastic saves in this first meeting between Sacramento and Oakland in the East Bay. It's Jordan Scarlett, who did score last time out against Vegas, gets into the fold here. That's a misplaced pass, and you can't do that with the battery lurking. It's a two-on-one with Williams over to the right. Oh, tremendous save by C.J. Cochran. Andrew Booth, so opportunistic, but then also the timing to make Castellanos come across, and that leaves Williams wide open. You know, hearing it from the San Antonio crowd. Blocked by far, and he hops on top of it to make sure that the cell can't clean that up. Keeper high. Not very strong, not even all the way in the corner, and Farr just read it all the way. Now they'll ease it back to Akwe. Throws in the build up here, another through ball attempt there by Akwe, or excuse me, by Ikaza. Here's a cross in the middle, Ruiz is there, and a stop by Lund. Take another look right here, beautiful cross, Ruiz is there, but Lund, those cat-like reflexes, keeps that one out of play. 